Hi, it's me again. Vargas Landscaping, El Tico. Uh, we are here again in Fullerton. And uh, now we are here in front of a beautiful orange tree that we, uh, we work in the morning. Um, when I talked to my customer, um, she told me that she wanted to probably thinking to remove the tree because the tree was dying. Uh, the tree is sick. Uh, and but she told me that this tree produced the best oranges in uh, Orange in, uh, or, uh, in uh, Orange County. And um, then I um, I didn't tell her anything. I just uh, thought about it. And um, after a while, I told her, "Well, we can um, give a restoration to this tree. Uh, try to cut all the dead material just because the tree has uh, two dead branches." Uh, like this one, this branch here is the one that we cut right here. We cut it from here, and this branch uh, we cut it from here, and it has uh, a lot of the material on the top. Then um, I, um, I I remove those two branches. My customer asked me uh, how come my tree is dying, so um, I I didn't I didn't tell her, but I thought about uh, maybe the tree had been neglected, uh, and not enough water. No enough water, and because the tree is on the slope, but she, she told me, well, I water often. Uh, yes, but most of the water that she was using in the tree, the, that water was running off right to the concrete in here. So I recommend her first, the restoration of the tree, removing all the dead material, and, and trees, uh, they don't give up easy. Look, look at this in here, This we have this, dead branch in here but look at this we have a, a nice green branch growing in here the tree most of the trees they don't give up real easy they are tough creatures so they will try to survive and then um my customers ask me well how long this tree how long this tree is going to be alive i said well probably longer than us I don't know, I, I, my, my customer laugh, uh, uh, but I probably it's true. Uh, even, even with this damage in here, all this in here is alive and the tree is going to continue to live nice and healthy. If for now on, we add to the tree the right amount of water during the summer month, July, August, September, and October, twice, twice a month twice a month a deep watering as i going to show you pretty soon and then a good fertilizer with organic fertilizer and a little bit of nitrogen as you can see this tree here is lack of nitrogen and also it looks like it's a lack of a uh, lack of uh, magnesium because of the uh, yellow 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 color in here and the green being in there so that is a, a symptom uh, uh, sometimes it's not totally clear, but it looks like a magnesium, nitrogen, um, and uh, uh, all those elements they uh, work in the chlorophyll uh, of uh, phenomenon of. Blah, 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 blah. Dance it like that. Okay, I want to. I want to. Uh, I want to show you how to do the right watering in this tree. Uh, first, we did the swell, or we, we built the ring. Now, we need to water deep. And I'm going to build the hole, so we need to take the time to do it right. And um, we get the hose in here, um, and our water, and our water. When we water a tree like this, let me show you, like this, the many of us, we do that. Uh, you do that in your house. You come in here and uh, you, need, you, need to, uh, you need to go to work uh, or you need to go and uh, um, take it to the kids. Uh, uh, you need to uh, go to uh, fix your hair and then you come in here and then you just forget to get your hose and you just uh, want that you pretend in here that you water the tree. Uh, good, you water the soil. 
You want it in here the top of the soil. You want it in here the top of the soil. One inch, two inch deep. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. What in here? I doubt it if you want to get the holes and stay here for ten minutes because you need to go go because you like to work, right? So you go one inch, two inches. This the root of this tree is two feet deep. So every time that you water fruit trees or any kind of tree, you need to uh, water long deep watering. The best thing will be like to leave a drip in here. A real a small drip in here and leave it for uh, eight hours. Leave the holes in there. But now, what I'm going to do in here for you to see what you need to do in there in your house, you need to put water in here. And that's if why we build this in here because building this this well in here, all this water that we put in here is going to stay, it's going to go down in the root system of the tree. If, if we don't have this, all this water, it will be right now, right here on the concrete. Right here on the concrete, like this in here, look at this. Put it in here. Look at what's going to happen. Look at what's going to happen. I'm not kidding. Look at what's going to happen. Uh, that's what's going to happen if you don't have the soil. Look at that. That's you water. You water and you see. All right. Uh -huh. So now you do it in here. This is the wrong way. This is the right way. Okay. I don't want you to pay. I don't want you to pay attention to me. I just want you to listen to me. Fill up this ring here so all the water go down two two foot down. I, I always confuse. I don't know if I say two foot or two feet, but the thing the the. What matter is that uh, this is a, um, I am giving you a, a talk about uh, taking care of trees, not to a, a, a grammar, English grammar. So I don't worry about it. If I say two feet or two foot. I am from Costa Rica. Fill it up that ring, fill it up the ring here. We need more water in there. Yeah, water is expensive and um, water is going to be um, pretty soon probably. We, we cannot water trees in this way because water is not going to be uh, available for us. But if, uh, if, if the water is available, we, this is the right way to do the water in the tree. But watering this once a month, this deep, or twice a month, I don't think we are wasting too much water, but that is practically what this tree needs to keep alive during the three or four difficult months during the summer, July, August, September, October. Build the swell like this, and then uh, you water deep. Yeah, again, if you don't build this swell, look at what is going to happen. Uh, this is uh, I am watering a tree without a swell. I am watering the tree without the swell. Look at what is going to happen. Again, look, and that happened in your house. Not only in here, it's going to happen in your house in Mexico, in Costa Rica, in Canada, in China or China, in uh, United States. So now we are going to do the right watering with the right the right way with the swell in the tree. No running off. Now it's almost there, so now we come in here and water the other one and put plenty of water in here also again. The right way to water 
Fruit fish on a slope. Talk about how the slope is. How they, uh, yeah, it's on a slope, but they have the. Uh -huh. Yeah. This is the border of the flower in here, with the ring, to stop the water from running off. Then all the water we put in there, the, all the water is going right to the root system of this tree. This is a mandarin, I think it's a Suma mandarin. As a nice branch structure, we already uh, clean all the dead material and, and remove a few of the suckers, and that's just all that this tree needs for pruning. See, and now look at this. This water already went down, so now we come here and water a little bit more. And the water is going all the way down to the root system of the tree. And that's what we're looking for. In these rings, uh, sometimes we need to go here on the top, we need to go deeper in there. So the water will stay in there. Uh, uh, it will be more uh, more space in there for the water to stay in there. See, this water went down already to the root system. We put more water in here. So we were watering, uh, we watering this fish tree, we watered um, in sequence. So once this, this 12 get full, but we need to take the time in the evening and just take a, a bad light with soco or take a Bavaria, or take a Imperial, and then uh, take your time to do the right water. And come in here now and fill up this again. Look at this is this is uh, the water went down. Not put water until you fill up all those. So that is the way that you do it. So um, I I believe that this is enough for you to see and to do the right practice at your house. So please. Push in there, uh, you like me and you uh, like this uh, video very much. Uh, this is very good for uh, very good ideas. Uh, you don't see this uh, in, uh, in many books or so you see that in video, but probably not in the way that I explain it to you in here. This is the, the right way to do it. So go home and do it. Thank you, thank you. See you next time. Hasta la vista.